Well, also tonight, since the news broke yesterday about a teen arrested in a triple murder case, we've been trying to learn more about the 15-year-old. Tonight, our country reporter Steve Jefferson found out why that 15-year-old is so familiar with the complex. Turn yourself in in a safe manner. The importance of others that may be involved in this incident to turn themselves in. Both police and community leaders call for the surrender for everyone involved in Sunday shooting that left these three roommates dead in an apparent robbery. A 15-year-old boy already under arrest is here at juvenile detention awaiting another hearing and possible murder charges. He has friends and everybody knows who those friends are. We need help getting them off the street. Metro officers responded to gunfire around 6 p.m. Sunday here at Somerset Lakes. They found the three victims inside their apartment. Eyewitness News uncovered a police report about the 15-year-old arriving at IU Methodist Emergency just before 9 p.m. Sunday. Police records also give an address for the teen murder suspect living in an apartment less than 300 feet away from where police found the victim. And here's what else we know. While living here at Somerset Lakes on May 14th, the teenager's father reported him as a runaway, saying he had not seen his son for three days. Now, police want to know who allegedly committed the deadly crime with the 15-year-old boy. Anyone with information on the two suspects who fled Somerset Lakes can call Crime Stoppers anonymously. That telephone number is 317-262-TIPS. On the Crime Beat, I'm Steve Jefferson.